Hey guys, this is Kidderop speaking and today we are going to finish up the tour that is our main season mid-go and our fitness is already dropping but we are doing pretty well, 92% we are almost at our fitness peak this middle peak just didn't work out it was poorly planned by myself and we are messing it all up but, and yeah, too much tiredness as you can see but well, I just hope the upcoming one will be a little better and um, last for longer. But anyway, let's uh, get right into the next race, which is not a hilly stage, as they proclaim, but rather a mountain stage, because this won't be easy. And here we go. Everyone is my teammate. A minus one once again. Yeah, something we gotta live with, I guess, but... Should be okay. Let's see. Um, oh no, our best helper has a minus two. That's not acceptable. Oh fuck. Okay. Everyone who's at least decent in something has... Oh no. This guy. Boom. Boom. He has a 60. <laughs> He's the next best dude. Oh fuck. Not good. Not good at all. Wow, this final climb is actually pretty steep. Around 9%. That won't be easy. And I think I want to reduce the uh, time a just slightly before we move into the first climb. And there we go. So, put you back on automatic. Ah, the peloton just ripped into parts, but um, rejoined immediately. The escapees have six minutes on the clock. Uh, I think we need to reduce this. Alright, halfway stage. The first mountains have been going well. Our team is just disintegrating right now. Uh, whenever this guy is riding, he can't even ride mountains. What the hell is going on? The escapees still have six minutes on the clock almost. Five and a half now. If it's going so slow, they uh, always gain massive amounts of time instantly. As you can see, 6.20 now. But there's a lot of... Um, difficult stuff coming before the finish line so I think they won't really pose a threat at least that maybe that's famous last words I don't know and just make sure that I have water for the final uh, final third of the race so let's take it while it's still a little calm and easy to rain so the escapees are just about to enter the second to last climb and I think I want to um, continue to like annihilate their time uh, no, it's it has been hovering around six minutes uh, let's uh, have my two guys who are not be going to be able to follow whatsoever up the uh, final two climbs just let them pull like really hard as now we're going into the flat and we can get about a minute on them I would think they won't be riding this piece very fast Oh yes, down to five minutes. Okay, that's much more to my liking than anything else. So uh, now you guys uh, just fall back, I assume. Nine percent slope, and Mechspec tries to stay up front. So far, it's going well. Uh, we are still protected, and pretty far up the uh, the group. How much more is there? Okay, the first step has been done. It's n almost 10%. Oh, 11%. Ouch. That's really fucking steep. So that's good to know for this final climb. We'll be going ultra slow up there. 12% even. What would be splendid is if my protector here. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah it's looking good. Liking. One kilometer left to go. Um, if he could follow along over the over the top, that would be great. It looks like it. They are trying to get away or no, not really. But what is worrying is that even though we've been moving so fast up this hill, there's still five minutes of a gap? What has been going on there? I'm just checking who these guys are. And they're all like 12 minutes back, so not really a threat. But still, I mean, it looks like they're going to win if they have that much advantage. Six minutes? If they kept this up over the whole climb here? That's very impressive. 
And I think my helper guy needs to actually go to the front and pull hard so that we further reduce the advantage. Okay, we're almost there. Almost there. Um, this didn't work out. He doesn't really want to do the job, it seems. And uh, just is stuck behind this guy. So let's go back to protecting instead. And McSpec needs to move up at 80? Four kilometers left? No, probably 85. We have full resistance bar. Oh yes. Oh yes, we are getting into a very nice spot. I wonder how much of this advantage will remain at the end. Let's take a quick look how much they have right now. So we are 5 minutes 30 back. And I almost got a bit of a gap here. Where? Where's my competition? Well, there's one. There's another. But Lambrecht is back here. Oh shit, he's a little bit stuck. Aha, uh -huh. this might be interesting. So if we just tell him... Uh, wait, this, this is just stay your position and then hang back. Save energy. But, um... I don't think he can actually protect me while going that this fast. Some dreadful percentages. No, he can't, really can't. So if I just tell him to stop right now and not do anything, then there should be a little gap forming if I go 90. Now oh, they are at my rear wheel. No, they aren't. They aren't. I have a little gap. Now they have to work to, to get back. Okay. That's very nice. That's very, very nice. 16 seconds, 12 seconds. Okay, they really have to work hard. He can't really do it. He's falling back again. Oh, that's brilliant. Such nice tactics, Max Speck. So now activate the Speck bar. And here we go. So very, very steep. And we can't really rely on... Um, the the sprint bar too much, but our resistance bar should last all the way up. It's just 3.6 kilometers left to go. So we can ride so hard that the the bars very very slowly disappear like this. Yeah, 52 seconds. I wonder what Lambrecht is going to do about this. There we catch one guy. Whoa! Look at the speed difference. <laughs> Fuck. This is massive. 1.9 kilometers left. Another two guys are caught. This is not much resistance bar left though. And there's the final kilometer coming up. I don't think we're going to catch those guys. And oh, there's already the... Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. No, that's good. But we have 1 minute 20 on them already. And victory. can we... No, we can't sprint himself. just yet. The Probably today. get the same time as those guys. And sprint, Mechpec! Sprint, get the same time as those guys! Yes! Yes, you did We're it. 7th! Alright! <laughs> that was good tactics right there. We created the little hole we needed just to get away from them. There was, like, our helper was at our back wheels. We told him to stop and then there was the gap so we could just go without launching an attack and alerting everyone else. And then they just couldn't keep up. <laughs> it was nicely played, I guess. So let's have a look at the general standings. One minute. Huh, <laughs> got a whole minute. And Lambrecht, um, how did he finish after us? Let's see, two minutes. I'm in the one minute 39 group and then, oh shit, those guys were back three minutes. Oh yep, yeah, that worked out in our favor. Whoa, what the fuck? Win the stage? Dude, we can't win every stage. Um, That's pretty good though. So, continue on. Okay, this stage is a really short one. Oh. Hmm, we are the favorite to win, but Lambrecht is looking pretty strong too. There's this kick at the end, which looks super, super steep. So you don't have to, for, don't forget that this is stretched, the stretched profile of this stage because it's so short. Oh, so it 
might be a lot steeper than it looks, but we shall see once um, the actual race starts. Okay, retain the leaders. Oh, fuck me. A minus two. That hurts. Fortunately, there's no hill or... Oh, this is a mile. These are pretty mild. I hope our helper dudes are not too terribly bad. Um, oh, they're good. Okay, let's use the flat to um, keep the advantage of the escapees down. Um, how about you? Flat 66? Yeah, let's, let's send you up to the front and do 75s as do you. That would be helpful. Okay, they still only have two minutes. <laughs> Pretty terrible, actually, for them. So... Uh, well done, guys. Um, continue pulling up the hill, though. And we need to get into a better position with McSpeck. Oh, they are going super hard. But then again, it's such a short stage, so it doesn't really matter. We are really containing these SKPs. Just two minutes and 20 there. That is not enough for the final climb. Which is very... Very gentle, for the most part. Strength sapping, for sure, but uh, pretty gentle, apart from this final little kick. I wonder how we best play this with Mech Speck. Uh, I think we uh, try to just max him out on this final bit. And pop our Speck bar there, right before. Oh, uh, another problem is the water. I don't think we will get any water anymore this stage. This is looking pretty bad. As this dude won't be able to return with any water. He got it for himself, but now he's dead. <laughs> that doesn't help, man. The riders are entering the last oh, wow. Of the stage. Roach is actually coming back with some water. He managed to get to Dicky McSpeck and all of us. He's our hero of today. Um you you can you can just hang back now, man. Thanks very thanks very much. That was excellent. Seven kilometers left to go and still one minute 28 on the escapees. Now, if that's uh, such a short stage, of course they also will have more stamina left. Uh, so, and he can't do anything anymore. Who can pull? Well, you're dead. Um, you're protecting me? No, you are not. Okay, you, you can move. 80? Yeah, 80. Alright, this is looking good. Oh, is he attacking? No, he's just pulling. It seems. Um, okay, how do we how do we approach this? Four point seven kilometers left. I think I need to pop my spec bar now, so that we have it for this kick, and then move into a good position. Maybe at eighty. Out of the side here. Yeah, that's looking great. And where is the kick? Things are hotting up at the front. Where is the kick? It's coming up right there. Where are my um, competitors? This dude is not on my list of... Oh, there is Lambrecht. Hmm. Can I trick them again? Maybe I could. Maybe I could try. So McSpeck accelerates even harder. 90. There we go. Yes, where is Lambrecht? Um, okay, he's still back there. I don't think he will be able to catch up if we now attack. And this should be right into the steep section. So, let's move. And let's, him, let's have him just drop back. And everyone else just stop with whatever they are doing. Like this. So they, they will be disorganized because they have no one who is going to um, attempt to pull right at the start to catch me. Now let's see how this goes. Yes. This guy is trying to follow. This time it could go all uh, I have a little gap. And I have Evolution a strong attack bar right There's now. 5% steep here. 14 seconds, 16 seconds. 19 seconds. Oh, that's a very strong attack. McSpeck. Now we should have more in the tank than the rest of them here. So we just pull through. Come on, McSpeck. Go, go, go. 
Is this Lambrecht? Oh yes, he's trying to follow me. He's trying to follow me. Can he catch up? Great victory. Uh, he really can he catch up? Well. No, he can't. Okay, I think we got a few more seconds on him. Race. Yes, we did get a few more seconds. Uh, 13 seconds. And uh, now we have minute 15 in the general classification. Who? Stage 4 of 5. 9 kilometer time trial. We are not among the favorites. <laughs> Difficult for Max Specht for uh, to hang on for to his jersey, yes. And I, I think we will do just fine, thank you very much. But if our race day condition is terrible, as it seems to be, then it might turn out pretty bad. Um, a minus five sure wouldn't help. All right, here we are. Uh, plenty of places to wait until we're all done. But this stage, oh, do I see some blackness in the slope I think I do uh, stage finish in the top three of the classification of the stage finish top of final overall standings okay so top three for the stage uh, quite steep as an optimistic but I think we can actually win this one if we do our our tricks with energy management all right, let's do it. And first see how this is going. Okay, he's trying to move hard. 180. He's trying to catch up with the bar, it seems. Yeah, that that is... If, if everyone is riding like this, then I think we can win. Because this is not optimal. Ah, uh, it's not too steep. Okay. Okay, it doesn't seem to be all too steep at the end. But it's hard to tell. Two riders left, one rider left, okay. So here we go. McSpeck, get ready. What is your race day condition? Please, please, plus... Okay. I think we're going to win this one. Plus one? That is amazing. All right, how do we uh, attack this? Uh, what is the slope? Uh, first, it's just a little downhill. So let's, um, let's do this at 72 or something. A little down it this is steep this is actually fucking steep so let's do it at 70 oh yeah this is really steep the best provisional time has just been beaten can even go down at 75 here yeah that doesn't use any energy very good minus two we are still going very fast of course maybe a little higher 80 don't use too much energy, McSpec. Minus two. This is this bit. Okay. Let's see how much how much time we have lost uh, until the first clock, the first intermediate time. We're going with 175 here. And there's the time. And we are only 10 seconds back. Okay, that sounds good. Uh, let's go 75 here for a moment while it's... Oh, this is not flat. This is everything but flat. Uh, 78. Uh, this might be a bit too fast. How much steeper does it get is the, uh, is the question. I think this is the, the biggest ramp we are in here right now. So, if we continue with this tempo, I think we should be good. Yeah, they are... In, like, this one is going about half speed of this one. I hope this works out. Maybe we can go a little harder. 80. Don't want to have much energy left. Now it's really not that steep anymore. So, go faster, Mechspec. Even faster. No! Go faster. Go as fast as you can. Yes, yes, perfect. And there we go. Oh, he's just moved ahead on the provisional time sheet. Oh, fuck. This was close. One. Oh, we did it. <laughs> By one second. We won. We won. Yes. Whoo. <laughs> Quite successful. And yeah, he's the much better time trialer. Um, our energy management there wasn't optimal, of course. 
Uh, I should have gone into this first bit of the mountain a little harder already. Uh, but it's so hard to tell if you can't follow along another rider on the stage as you could in the previous years of uh, Pro Cycling Manager. Um, maybe it is still possible somehow, but I haven't seen how that would be possible. So, um, otherwise I would have been following around a rider over the whole stage to really check how steep the sections are, so that I better can um, can calculate how hard I should be going on these sections. I did think that it would be steeper at the end, so yeah, that didn't quite work out. Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> Look at it now! And the day we get our fitness peak, of course our fitness has dropped below 90, so we can't get it anymore. That's a shame, really. That's a shame. And it is the final day. What a monster climb at the end. Here we go, and Dicky McShrek has a zero! That should be entirely possible. Let's hope we get... Wow, this final climb is actually bonkers. Uh, the steep bit at the end will kill people. But our best helper does have a plus two. That's good news. So far so good. We are controlling the escapees very nicely. And these roads are tiny. Oh... My. Okay, but we are in a very good position, so I don't really mind. Um, now starts the actual climb, and it's super steep. What kind of crazy climb is this? I don't know, like an average gradient of uh, like 12% or something, Mortirolo style. We are getting them before the... F this climb features wow. some dreadful percentages. We're almost catching them before the first top, it seems. Hey, the mountain rider is... Uh, the mountain jersey is back in the penalty now. I think I'll just go ahead and... get myself some points. Yeah, yeah, that works out. Whoa, I'm expect really pulls there. Okay. Oh, we're back. <laughs> yes. Uh, sorry, um... Boom? El Boom? They completely destroyed the whole peloton, but now we are slowed right down. Oh, this is the same climb? No, no, it's not. Why? Why is this? Why is the finish line up here? Oh, I see. Look at that. This is. We're going back up this mountain later on. You see this? It's symmetric. Yeah, it is. Okay, and the finish is up there. So now we are going down. What we are later going up. And this is a super tiny group we have here. <laughs> oh, look at it. It's just this guy up front. Like one rider. And we are in a bunch of of riders that don't really want to ride. Where is the rest of the peloton? Come on. No one has got his teammates anymore. Uh, an they attack. are attacking from here. That seems a little odd. That's a very, very far distance to go. Maybe we just need to ride a little faster than this. Um, otherwise, we have more attackers going, and I don't want that. Now the peloton is in decent size once again, too. And from the looks of it, we are going to catch them again. <laughs> oh, poor escapees. It's not their day. Uh, more of them are going. But none of them are really competent enough to um, scare me. Apart from maybe this guy, if he has a good day, then he might do something. We did check. Yeah, that was a tactical mistake by me there. I did too, get too close to the escape group uh, because then new riders can jump across the gap. That's something you never should do. That's a mistake on my part. Oh fuck! Water bottles. Um, you, you go and fetch water bottles right now. There comes the water. Very good. Well done. We are moving pretty... Oh, why, why is... Why is Mechspec not getting into position? Uh, maybe because he's riding too hard on this flat bit here. The pack is putting the squeeze on the breakaway. Some team managers mustn't appreciate the fact that there is a breakaway, given that the pack has increased its speed. Oh, they are moving super hard into this final climb, though. On the flat. 
almost flat. Well, it's a hill, basically. 4%. A rolling hill. Okay, 9 kilometers left. And we are in the final climb. So, I think McSpeck is now just going at 80. And Lambrecht is following. Yes, he is. Okay. And these two guys can just dump it and ride to the finish as slowly as they want. <coughs> We've almost caught the escapees already. There they are. Maybe we're going a little fast here right now. Uh, I should not it's forget that I am the fastest if I want to, so I don't have to uh, to wear them out necessarily. Though I've gotten them down to 11 riders already. I have 4.2 kilometers left. I think I want to have my spec bar in this steep bit, so I should pop it now. Just six riders left. Five riders left. <laughs> Four riders left. Now they're trying to accelerate here, it seems. Yeah, yeah, they're trying to. I don't mind. You guys go ahead. Uh, we're almost in the steep bit. Uh, let's go back up to 80. And now McSpeck is in the very steep bit. And we're almost there. But I... Hmm, two points... Yeah. I think we could place an attack, basically. Just go at 95. Attack! Come on! No! 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 Go, come on, McSpeck! Yes! Yes, yes, yes! McSpeck is going for victory! Um, why can they follow so nicely? No, okay, they can't. Um, one more kilometer left. This shouldn't be too tough. And the final sprint is there! Who's yes! Five! To five! Yes! Come on! McSpeck, you still have something left in you! Sprint! Sprint! There's something more there! Yeah, Super perfect! <laughs> perfect! Oh, look at that! 37 seconds! It, it was well this played! Was well played, Mick Speck! You did it! It looked like they were able to follow there for a second. I got kind of scared. We've selected the following highlights for you. Oh, there is Mick Speck coming across the crest! And into the finish. And they are just... Oh, they look so wasted! Completely destroyed this tour. Mechspec is our hero of the day. Let's see what our team says. 41 seconds on him! Wow! So, what did we get? Finish top of the final standings. Good. Uh, win the stage. Good. Exceptional in the point standings. First in the mountain standings. Exceptional. First in the youth standings. Exceptional. We got everything. Now, <laughs> that's good news. 70 points. That's, that's massive. Well, very nicely done, Mechspeck. I think your um, contract negotiations will go pretty well. But now tiredness 70%. Yeah, it's a little rough. But uh, that is something we take a look at in the next episode, where we are going down the drain when it comes to fitness and then up on the other side again. So um, I hope you enjoyed. And see you guys next time! <laughs>